Well, I've made this lure retriever, and I'm gonna show you how it works. So I'm stuck. This clip right here, I'm gonna attach it to your main line. I'm just gonna slide the lure retriever down the main line. your plug and once it gets to your lure you're just going to jerk it up and down so it knocks it free and then once it knocks it free you have your, your lure back dollar lure hung on a tree so it's definitely hung on a tree as you can see the piece and this is just a place to store the lure retriever and I'll just let you reel up the slack line this do-it-yourself lure retriever It'll save you a lot of money and get your base back. Happy fishing. Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make a lure retriever using a key ring, size 5 barrel swivels with interlock snap, two 3 ounce inline trolling sinkers, which I added number 5 barrel swivels with interlock snaps too. I've got five pieces of chain that I took from a nine snap chain stringer. I just use a pair of pliers, bent out these links and separated them. And I made five separate chains. You're gonna start off by taking your key ring and just start adding the five pieces of chain. So there you have the Piece of chain on there. Now I'm going to add my inline trolling sinker. And I added these extra barrel swivels with interlock snaps so it would fit over because the swivel on this interlock snap is bigger. Whereas what's the factory on this inline trolling sinker is too small. So you're going to add two of these three ounce trolling sinkers. So now you have your lure retriever and you're going to add this barrel swivel with interlock snap on. This will allow you to clip that to your main line of the lure you're trying to retrieve. So this is what's going to be sliding down and it will hit your plug 
And if it's a crankbait, these chains will get tangled up in the hooks, which will allow you to pop it free. If it's just a plastic, these lead will knock it out, most likely. So I'm using two three ounce trolling sinkers, which gives me a total of six ounces. So it's a pretty heavy setup. The lure retriever. Now that I got my lure retriever made, I took this rod that was broken in shipping and I fabricated it with this guide at the top. Added a crappie jigging reel, spooled it with some 65 pound braid, and this is just going to give me a way to retrieve my lure and retriever after I slide it down my main line. I'm going to attach my lure retriever to my line with a palomar knot. So after you tie your knot, everything's going to be ready to go. When your crankbaits are hung up down in the wood, this thing falls down on them, and it'll hang those hooks, and you'll be able to pop it free. Try making one of these, save yourself a lot of money, retrieving all those expensive crankbaits and lures. Please subscribe. Thanks for watching.